you all for gathering here today. Before we start, I invite Minister Lee to deliver a sermon for us. Minister Lee. Thank you, Gail. Well, nice having everyone out on this very cold day. I'm going to keep this short since the smell is oh so good. Django, you're getting good at this. I'm going to tell the story of how the winter solstice tradition got started. Long ago, in the bleakest period of the Age of Darkness, there was no light to be found. People rose in the morning and went to bed at night in total blackout. Food was scarce, and the crops were failing, and it was cold. Very, very cold. Many people died. On an especially cold winter solstice, a few of the stragglers started a fire to keep warm. When one of them suddenly said, I still have a can of beans. Let's heat it up and share it. Someone followed by saying, That's not enough. I still have some mushrooms. Let me put that in as well. One after another, people gave up what they had left. By the time they were done, the pot was full of wonderful and filling things. These people ate and laughed and went on to survive that day, and the next, and the day after that, until the sun finally came out. Even though we're seeing better times now, we need to remember what got us through those dark times. We shared what we had, helped one another, and together we made our current world possible. So please, never forget that. God bless. Thank you for that wonderful sermon, Minister. Now then, everyone, let's throw in what we have. That smells so delicious. Let's get ready to eat. Hi. So in this event, Emily has a food cell where you can purchase ingredients to throw into the hot pot. You can bring ingredients from home to use too. Fish gives a lot of relationship points, so I recommend that you catch a bunch before the event starts. So when you see someone requesting an ingredient, it should be on top of their head. Go to your clip bar and click on it to throw the food in. You will automatically receive points from that person. I recommend when you're grabbing things from your inventory to place it on a slot where you highlight it last so you can throw it in quickly. If your goal is to keep the spiciness over 85 for 10 seconds to get a true hot pot achievement, wait until about 1300 when the spiciness bar is high and get a large amount of chili peppers to throw in. You can get them beforehand from Sophie's Ranch, grow it, or gather it at the desert. Feel free to play the Snowball Flight minigame. You can also take group photos at Central Plaza around 1800. That's all. Thank you for listening and have fun.